Time for another Star Wars drawing, guys. Pew pew! We're gonna be doing a Stormtrooper. Here we go. Alright, we're gonna start off on this drawing real quick and uh, we're gonna do my normal chimmy, uh, chibi, <laughs> sorry I can't talk, my chibi style drawing. And uh, we start off with a normal egg shape and then uh, we start from there. Uh, it is not quite normally a head, it's actually a helmet. And uh, we have to start off drawing that first. So what we do is just trying to give a feel of what the helmet's supposed to be like. Uh, the Stormtrooper has kind of like these like big puffy cheek type of things on their mask. And now you want to make sure you emphasize that. Kind of like a, think about it kind of like a squirrel. How squirrels have puffy cheeks. And that's kind of like what a Stormtrooper has. And you kind of want to make uh, add detail after that. So once you have the basic shape of the helmet like I'll have over here, you're going to start water, uh, wanting to add the linear lines to create the more form and then the, the more detail. So uh, here we go. Um, he has kind of like shades on him. Or her, I guess. <laughs> it, could be, it can be a guy or a girl, I guess. And then um, kind of want to round it out with the top of the head. And then add some like nice dark features because it's gonna be very dark and then very uh, light as it is only just black and white. Uh, so you're gonna add some like nice defining lines and then uh, add some shadow. And I'm probably gonna go straight to uh, pit pen real quick so I can uh, kind of see where I'm going with this because sometimes it's kind of hard. So you can see I'm doing the black and the uh, I don't know what they're called. I guess uh, goggle area. Um, I don't know why I'm not thinking of the correct word. I don't know. It's it's fiction, so <laughs> I guess that's good. So uh, and then kind of has like this little uh, duck brow or duck type of deal of a, I don't know of a beak going on with this uh, nice uh, narrow and astute helmet. But um, here we go as I try to outline the rest of the uh, places. It looks like there's like some sort of like breathing hole <laughs> on the bottom, a left hand of uh, that helmet himself that he has. Um, so as we define this a little more, we can start moving on to the rest of the body. So I'm gonna switch back to my color pencil. Here we go. And up with the blue. And as I notice uh, when I'm drawing this thing, uh, I did the shoulders a little bit higher than normal, and I'll fix that when I get to uh, the um, the sharpie again. But um, this is supposed to be the shoulder plates. And then as I go smaller, uh, it's basically just building this white, the white parts of um, his outer shell, basically. And that's how I'm trying to figure out how to do right now. So he's gonna be holding a gun. So his back hand's gonna be holding the trigger, and then his front hand is gonna be holding underneath, and it's gonna be holding kind of like a rifle. So I'm trying to figure out how he's gonna hold the gun. I should have drawn the gun first, or the outline of the gun. So I know what I'm doing. As you can see, I'm using pencil for the ruler, and it's gonna be pointing down, so you can see where he's shooting, even though they have really bad aim. Or I guess that's the uh, whole rumor about the uh, stormtroopers are. <laughs> but uh, anyways, uh, the front hand is gonna be covered by the gun, and then the back hand hopefully uh, can cover the trigger. And um, when it comes to their blasters, it's not normally any uh, specific gun. You can make your own sci-fi gun. I'm trying to draw the fingers here, wrapping around, um, add more variety. And then uh, his front knuckle is going to be covering that little trigger happy um, little trigger right there. Draw a little bit more of the gun down here, and uh, hopefully I can get a nice good look of the back end where you put the shoulder piece in. That's basically it. So as you can see here, I'm trying to fix the shoulder pieces. I'm trying to bring them down a little bit lower. Um, there we go, and then I'm gonna outline with the black micron or the black uh, um, <laughs> the uh, the black uh, prisma color. There we go. That's the word. <laughs> I'm trying to think of the brand. Sorry, uh, black prisma color uh, marker. I'm trying to outline where I'm going on so I can have a clear view of what I'm doing. There we go. I always try to go back with the with the marker where I can clearly see a vision of what I'm trying to do, and then. I go back with card pencil or pencil itself so I can get uh, a feel of what I'm trying to sketch uh, as I go on. And uh, as you can see, I'm more confident, so I try to go in with the blacks. And then when I'm less confident, I go back in with the card pencil or the normal pencil as I try to uh, add more detail. And, and I am looking at another picture while I'm doing this, so keep that in mind. I'm not doing this off my memory. I'm looking at a photograph of, from an actual still from the movie. And uh, it looks like they have like, these little things in the belt. Kind of looks like the Batman belt, kind of. Add a little more three-dimensional uh, features on there. I'll add shadow a little bit. Uh, there we go. There's a shadow. And uh, we're going to move on to the lower parts of the body. That's why I switched over to uh, color pencil again. It kind of has like this little pelvis uh, armor with a white. And then, as again, like I say, I'm trying to shape the uh, armor itself, or the body himself, with just the white armor. 
I don't normally do this with my drawings, and then I go back with a shadow later on. And um, there we go, little boot. I, don't, I try not to add so much detail to the uh, rest of the body because the main focus when you do these tribby style drawings is the head and then the uh, arm, armature features. And then uh, I'm gonna align with black as I finish this drawing. And there we go, I'm gonna do the other leg. And uh, that's basically how to draw a Stormtrooper. It's really simple. It's one of my easiest drawings that I've done. But uh, that's basically it. Hope you guys enjoy this drawing. Um, I plan to do more Star Wars drawings in the future so you guys can see that. And uh, that's basically it. Um, see you guys. <laughs> guess, see you guys next time. Peace.